Thank you, Mr. Speaker. The senior representatives of Israel continue to use language endorsing genocide against Palestinians. President Netanyahu said that IDF would turn Gaza into rubble, and a senior leader in the Israeli army has said that in Gaza there will be no electricity and no water, there will only be destruction. And on LBC radio last week, the Israeli ambassador advocated for the full destruction of Gaza and said there is no alternative. I wrote to the Foreign Secretary last week to ask him to condemn the genocidal words of the Israeli ambassador. He refused. So will the minister now condemn her remarks and commit to taking the strongest possible action against her? Minister. Uh, no, uh, Mr. Speaker, but what I can tell him is that in respect of the humanitarian difficulties that uh, he has identified. We are doing everything we can to try and secure unhindered humanitarian uh, access, and we will continue to do so. It has been noticed on social media, public is also questioning Tory government to take action and justify why supporting Israel. Looks, they are failed so far. Tariq Lodi, KTV News, Manchester. KTV News, Wise from UK only.